And now it's time for Silly Songs with Larry, the part of the show where Larry comes out and sings a silly song. Larry will be performing the traditional Argentinian ballad, The Dance of the Cucumber, in its original Spanish. Bob the Tomato will translate. Miren al pepino. Watch the Bien cucumber. Como se See mueve. how he moves. Como un león. Like a lion. Tras un Chasing a mouse. Miren al pepino. Watch the cucumber. Que suave es oh, how smooth his motion. Es como like butter en un chango. on a pelón. bald monkey. Miren al pepino. Watch the cucumber. Los vegetales. All the vegetables. Envien a su amigo. Envy como friend. él quiere bailar. Wishing to dance as he. Pepino bailarín. Dancing cucumber. Pepino Dancing cucumber. Pepino Dancing cucumber. Baila, baila dance, ya. dance, yeah. Miren el tomate. Look at the tomato. No es triste. Isn't it sad? Él no puede bailar. You can't dance. Pobre tomate. Poor tomato. Él desearía poder bailar como el pepino. He wishes he could dance like the cucumber. Libre y suavemente. Free and smooth. Pero no puede danzar. But he, he can't. Okay, stop the music. What do you mean I can't dance? I can dance. Well, what about Uncle Louie's polka party? Didn't you see me dancing at Uncle Louie's polka party? No comprendo. No comprendo? I'll show you no comprendo. Mom, Dad, look over here. Get a picture of me next to the cucumber in authentic Argentinian garb. Okay, Junior, but we better hurry. I think the dwarves have your mother confused with someone else. <laughs> Say peas. Peas. Escuchen al pepino. Listen to the cucumber. Oigan su voz fuerte. Como un león. Like a lion. Listo a devorar. About to eat. Escuchen al pepino. Listen to the cucumber. Que dulce es su canto. How sweet his voice. Que sopla su garganta. The from his throat is like a chorus of little birdies. Escuchen al pepino. Listen to the cucumber. Los vegetales. All the vegetables. Envíen a su amigo. Como él quiere cantar. Pepino cantador. Singing cucumber. Pepino cantador. Singing cucumber. Pepino cantador. Singing cucumber. Sing, sing, yeah. Escuchen al tomate. Listen to the tomato. No es triste. Isn't it sad? Él no puede cantar. He can't sing. Pobre tomate. Poor tomato. Él desearía poder cantar. He wishes he could sing. Fuerte y luce como el pepino. Strong and sweet like the cucumber. Pero no puede. But he can't. Ni siquiera da un solvido. Can't even whistle. All right, that's it, senor. Come over here and let me sing you a song. Adios, amigos. This has been Silly Songs with Larry. Tune in next time to hear Larry sing. Bob is really angry. I hope he doesn't catch me. It's so hard to run with the sombrero on my head. yours too. Is it a Jeep? A Subaru? I like your tires. You've got nice chrome. A trailer hitch. Left mine at home. Oh, your suspension, it suspends me over heights I've never known. And your roll bar is to die for, by the way. I like your chrome. You already said that. Did I? Yeah. Oh. Utility vehicles cruising to 7 Eleven for a bag of Frito Lays. Oh, you and me in our sport utility vehicles. We'll slam into four wheel drive and pick up a dozen eggs. And if there ever was a snow, you know, a really, really deep snow. And if everyone was stuck but us, we'd be the ones not stuck. Then we could be the heroes.
like your car. I like yours too. Periwinkle. It's baby blue. How's it handled? Like a dream. How about coffee? And then ice cream. songs with Larry, the part of the show where Larry comes out and sings a sing song. Uh, Bob the tomato, uh, unable to sneeze, visits the sneeze doctor. Please, can someone help me? I need to sneeze. Wait for the sneeze, doctor. <laughs> Just take a seat. He'll be right with you. If you have to sneeze, if you need to, don't hold it in. Just be sure that you cover your mouth with a tissue. I will assist you. Sneeze all your troubles away. Add up to 150 miles an hour. Interesting fact. The average sneeze travels at a rate of 100 miles an hour. In 2003, Dirk Evert of Grunholz, Germany, clocked in at 150. Way to go, Dirk. Danke. I think I have a remedy. Perhaps <laughs> in my potpourri. I bought it from a merchant in Spain. For ultimate sneeze satisfaction, we try to learn. Reaction. Take a deep breath. If it helps, you can squint at the sun. Oh, here's some pepper. Let's see. I know. I can try this pepper. Don't be afraid. Set it free. Let it go. 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 Go, 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 go. Interesting fact, the photic sneeze reflex, or sneezing when exposed to bright light, is a genetic trait found in 25% of the population, including Dirk. Gesundheit, which interestingly means good health in German. Yeah. Sneeze if you have to. Sneeze if you need to. Take a part of your life. Ah! Silly songs with Fanny. Tune in next time to hear Dirk say, Ich bin ein Schneezer. You're on. What's my line? Just read the script. I don't have one. Larry, where's the script for the silly song? Oops. Don't tell me you forgot. I've got a song. You're a lifesaver. 
a biscuit of Zazamor and the bow. It lies atop a mound of snow. High in the hills where the cold winds blow, it's the biscuit of Zazamor and the bow. Come on! <laughs> let's go! <laughs> a biscuit of Zazamor and the bow. Our bags are packed and ready to go. Let's start the van and be gone. Start the van and be gone now. Our bags are all packed and we're ready to go. Let's start the van and be gone. Come on, oh, man. let's go! Oh, 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 what did you say? We can't leave here today. You've just got an errand to run. I just have to stop at the bank. You just have to stop at the bank? Well, if you insist, I suppose, we can deal with a minor delay. Deal with a minor delay. Say, Archibald, who made this biscuit anyway? Oh, I thought you'd never ask. So James McNabb of the Guild of Go, he made the biscuit so long ago, and the people they traveled to see it glow all the around the of Zazamor and the bow. Come on, let's go! Hey, the biscuit of Zazamor and the bow. Oh, what is it now? This isn't the way. I just need to stop for some goldfish food. You don't even have a goldfish. No, but I was thinking of getting one, and I wouldn't want him to go hungry. Anybody need anything? Uh, maybe a venti half calf vanilla hazelnut latte? Hold the whipped cream. <laughs> and maybe one of those little chocolate covered graham crackers? So, Archie, what's so great about this biscuit anyway? Well, if you really want to know, the biscuit of Zazamor and the bow was lost to the world many years ago until my great uncle Archibo stubbed his toe on the frozen dough of the biscuit of Zazamor and the bow. Come on! Please! No tears! No, not again! It's just not fair! You gotta have a map! A uh, what? A map! A what? A map! Oh, oh a, a map! map. The biscuit of Zazamorandibo! The biscuit of Zazamorandibo! The joy! The thrill! I think I spilled the biscuit! The biscuit! The biscuit, the biscuit of Zazamorandibo! Uh-oh. Mmm, sausage gravy. Huh. I might have made a wrong turn. The biscuit of Doug? <gasps> back to the van! Back to the van! It isn't too late! Let's go! So high in the hills where the cold winds blow, the biscuit of Santa Miranda Moe. We're almost there! Oh, isn't this great? Who needs to take a party break? Me! I'm here! No! I suppose this has been Silly Songs with Archie. Tune in next time to hear Larry say. I always thought you were the announcer. So did I. And now it's time for Silly Songs with Larry, the part of the show where Larry comes out and sings a silly song. Today, Larry and Bob are on a photo safari, hot on the trail of a monkey or an ape. We don't know which, hence the song. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey, even if it has a monkey kind of shape. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey, it's an ape. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey. Oh, let's see if we can catch it on the tape. You can very plainly see if it's a monkey. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey, it's an ape. Look, there it goes, there it goes. I don't know, I can't tell if it's a monkey or an ape. It's very simple, Bob. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey, it's an ape. Oh, uh, Larry, I'm not so sure. Ooga booga, it's not a monkey. Ooga booga, maybe it's an ape. <laughs> if it's a nickel or a salad or a pillow, if it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey, it's an ape. If it doesn't have a tail... Not a monkey. Are you sure that's what you really mean to say? A, a camera has no tail. It's not a monkey. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey. It's an ape. Huh. I think there's something wrong with your logic, Larry. Well, Bob, the lady at the zoo said it. And who am I to tell her that she's wrong? If there's a tail, it's a monkey. No tail, ape. It's easy. But, Larry, a kite has a tail. Then it's a monkey. A comet has a tail. It's a monkey. A bubble doesn't. Then it's not a monkey. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey. It's an ape? Exactly. I knew you'd catch on. Larry, we might need to talk about this. I don't think the lady at the zoo meant... Look, there it goes in the trees. Follow me. It's got to be a monkey or an ape. I can't believe it's true. All this time I've searched for you. Snap the picture. Take the shot. We're a 
Among the lucky few, we finally did it. Photographer, we've discovered what we're after. Let me look. Is it an ape? Larry, this is a disaster. <laughs> it's a monkey. <clears throat> uh, Larry, uh, that's a cow. Uh, not that a... was exhilarating. Let's uh... find more. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey. Even if it has a monkey kind of shape. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey. It's an ape. This has been Silly Songs with Larry. Tune in next time to hear Bob say... Uh, Larry, you don't have a tail. I don't? Nope, and neither do I. I wouldn't be so sure about that, Bob. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. Whoa. And now it's time for Silly Songs with Larry, the part of the show where Larry comes out and sings a silly song. Uh, Bob the tomato, uh, unable to sneeze, visits the sneeze doctor. Please, can someone help me? I need to sneeze. Wait for the sneeze, doctor. Just take a seat. He'll be right with you. Sneeze if you have to. Sneeze if you need to. Don't hold it in. Just be sure that you cover your mouth with a tissue. I will assist you. Sneeze. All your troubles away Add up to 150 miles an hour Interesting fact The average sneeze travels at a rate of 100 miles an hour In 2003, Dirk Evert of Grunholz, Germany Clocked in at 150 Way to go, Dirk Danke I think I have a remedy Perhaps <laughs> in my potpourri I bought it from a merchant in Spain. For ultimate sneeze satisfaction, we try allergic reactions. Take a deep breath. If it helps, you can squint at the sun. Or here's some pepper. Let's see. I know. I can try this better. Don't be afraid. Set it free. Let it go. 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 Go, 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 go. Interesting fact. The photic sneeze reflex, or sneezing when exposed to bright light, is a genetic trait found in 25% of the population, including Dirk. <laughs> Gesundheit, which interestingly means good health in German. Yeah. Sneeze if you have to. Sneeze if you need to. Silly songs with Betty. Tune in next time to hear Dirk say, Ich bin ein Schneezer. Now it is time for Classy Songs with Larry, the part of the show where Larry comes out and sings a classy song. Waiting for the trolley, he had a hat, my high silk hat. He wore it high upon his head so proudly, a beautiful hat, my high silk hat. A hat like this just makes him feel so grandly. Now fancy this and fancy that. The splendor of this hat in all its majesty, like a king in a royal cap. I feel so swell and handsome in my hat. I bet that others wish they had, in fact, a hat 
Is this a hat? Is that a hat? So high now, high so fast! Oh, Mr. Art Bugatti, now what do you think of that? Now his hat was not all he was so proud he, I must in fact share more than that. For upon his lap there sat a treat so fungy of chocolate this and chocolate that. Deliciousness that makes him feel so dandy, a chocolate bliss, a chocolate snack. Inventions such as these are more than candy, somewhat like mine, about so bad. I have my chocolate placed upon my lap, I feel so good you just cannot top that. I have my snack of chocolate, pack of chocolate, this and chocolate that. Oh golly, Mr. Nazar, now what do you think of that? Upon his hat and stop his neck. So beneath his hat he thought and pondered. What should I do to save my hat? He thought and contemplated as he perspired beneath his hat. Upon his hat. He feared his chocolate treats would soon retire and to a pool. A chocolate bath. I won't feel grand if I take off my hat. The sun's getting hot. My hat, it might go flat, and my sweets will melt like that. Oh, hurry, Mr. Trolley, before my damp furnace goes flat. He decided to forego his looks so dashing to save his hat. And eat a snack. So he placed the treats upon the seat beside him and put his hat on top of that. Oh, please. Oh, please, oh, please. Don't anybody sit close to me. Sit close to me. Upon my hat. Upon my hat. I ask if all of you could be so kindly and just stand back away from my snack. A great big squash just sat upon my hat. A great big squash just squished my hat real flat. He squashed my hat, he made it flat. He squished my snack. Oh, what a that! Oh, tell me anybody, now what do you think of that? A great big squash just sat upon my hat. Oh, golly! Uh, what's your name? They've never given me a name. I've been around since show one, and I still don't have a name. Now, what do you think of that? And now it's time for Ukulele Karaoke with Bob, the part of the show where Bob comes out and sings an Ukulele Karaoke. Uh, what's going on? You are doing the Ukulele Karaoke, no? No, I'm on a break. Uh, this is the Pirates. They are busy with the rest of the show. But I, I, I don't even know the song. Your lyrics, monsieur. Bring in the props. Uh, but wait, I... I Monsieur! Hold on a sec. I'm totally unprepared to do a solo. Your backup singers. What? Isn't that the... Three. They are the Wiggly Turtle Tubies. The Wiggly Turtle Tubies? They look taller on TV. So do you, Tomato! Uh, but really, this is Larry's gig. I can't just... This show must go on, Monsieur. Quick, that is your cue. Just follow along, you will be fine. But... Let's that turtle. Aloha, Lance. Lance and Turtle, dance, dance, dance. Lance and Turtle, Aloha Lance. Lance and Turtle, dance, dance, dance. Well, I keep a little turtle at my uncle and my aunt's. My Annie's name is Myrtle and my island turtle's name is Lance. He doesn't wander far, even if he has a chance. He just plays his ukulele and he does the hula dance. What? Lance and Turtle, Aloha Lance. Lance and Turtle, dance, dance, dance. Lance and Turtle, Aloha Lance. Lance and Turtle, dance, dance, dance. He threw a luau barbecue one breezy summer night. Invited all his turtle pals to come and have a weeky bite. The turtle started walking there as Lance began to swing. The one that lived across the street arrived there in the spring. Oh, I get it. Turtles are slow. <laughs> so I took them a long time. <laughs> That's pretty good. Lance and Turtle. Aloha, Lance. Lance and Turtle. Dance, dance, dance. 
But Lance just kept on cooking. He was grilling full of glee. He was marinating ribs, cause he likes uh, syrup with his feta cheese. Uh, I'm sorry, I. Lance's purple turtle shell has ketchup, if you please. Pineapples are shiny, spotted tiki bumblebees. Oh man. Lance and turtle. Hello, Hollands. Lance and turtle. Uh, oh, wait a minute. Hey, guys, I don't think this is right. It doesn't make any sense. It works for us. <laughs> but this one, this one. Uh, there are luscious chocolate fingers spinning slowly in the school. Malay Kalikimaka. Fluffy bunnies driving in the pool. Uh, Larry. A thousand igloos wax the beach, spray luggage in the tree, raining puppies, flying clown, flossing Puna Hale. Ow! Oh, forget it. Woohoo! La Pagas Weezy's coconuts, tahini yo yo leg, white mini whiskey jelly floss, the meg the fuzzy parrot bag, paper plastic porcupine, the horsey makes his bed, the huma huma nuku nuku abwa I was in bed. Lance and Turtle. Hello, Hollands. This has been Ukulele Karaoke with Bob. Tune in next time when Bob says... I'll be in my dressing room. Dance, dance, dance. And now it's time for Silly Songs with Letty. The part of the show where Letty comes out and sings a silly song. I remember the day you came my way. I was so young. Chewing days had not begun. La, la, la. Then I saw you protrude. Oh, there you are. I put away my baby food. La, 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 la. When you peeked out at me, I knew it was meant to be. It was meant to be. My only tooth, my lonely tooth, my all by itself in the middle of my mouth, too. Happy Tuesday to you. up so fast and as time passed la, la, I thought la. there'd be more two three or maybe four but la, there you la, stood la. so white la, la, nobody's la. to your left or right la, la, and I knew I was done he be my only one my only two my only two my all by Tuesday to you. I got you a present. Since you've been all by yourself, I got you some buddies. Some tooth buddies. Happy Tuesday to you. Happy Tuesday to you. Happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday to you. What's up? A little crowded? Well, just give him a chance. My only tooth, my lonely tooth, my all by itself in the middle of my mouth tooth. That's okay, Larry. We all got you two toddies. Happy Tuesday! Happy Tuesday! Happy Tuesday to you! Tune in next time to hear Bob say, Happy Tuesday, Larry. Hey! And now it's time for Silly Songs with Letty Boy, the part of the show where Letty Boy comes out and sings a silly song. We join the league at supper time as they sit down for a meal prepared by Alfred. I don't want to eat my Brussels sprouts. He doesn't want to eat his Brussels sprouts. And I really, really don't like sauerkraut. Icky, slimy, stinky sauerkraut. My appetite is zero. No need to shed a tear -o. You need a supper hero. What's a supper hero? Got tails you don't want to chew. Yeah, not too appetizing. Don't wanna eat what's cooked for you. No, not really. 
and citizen, don't fear oh, I am the superhero. He is the superhero. Yummy, 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 Thanks. I like this superhero. This pasta dish has gotten cold. I beg your pardon? This fish stick looks a little old. It's not that old. You can't go on, I must insist. It's my duty to assist. Well, I'm kind of hungry. Good citizen, don't fear -o. I am the supper hero. He is the supper hero. Yum, 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 I was going to eat that. Don't worry, folks, for me it's fun. A supper hero's job's not done. Yummy, 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 yum, yum, yum. Till every supper plate is clean, no matter what type of cuisine. Yummy, 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 yum, yum, yum. Who let him in? Hey, is that chocolate? I love chocolate. Oh, wait! Yummy, 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 yum. Yummy, 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 yum, yum. Ah, good citizens, don't fear, oh, and be of good cheer, oh. I love my new career, oh. I am the supper hero. Dude, he ate our cake. So, what do you say, guys? Can I join the league? This has been Silly Songs with Letty Boy. Tune in next time to hear the league say... No. Yummy, 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 yum. And now it's time for The Blues with Letty, the part of the show where Letty comes out and sings the blues. Hey, everybody. I'm gonna lay down some blues. All sunshine and roses, no rain came my way. I said, all sunshine and roses, no rain came my way. Mm -mm. My dad bought me ice cream. Oh, happy, 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 happy day. up that ice cream, got some on my face. That's right, right on my face. I said, I ate up that ice cream, got some on my face. Got some on the table. Oh, happy, sticky, happy, sticky, happy, happy, sticky, happy place. Hey, man, what you doing? I'm singing the blues. Oh, man. The blues is for singing when you feel sad. But I don't feel sad. Man, you got no business singing the blues. Here, let me help you out. Take this. <gasps> cool, ice cream. Thanks. Now give me back that ice cream. You took my ice cream. You took it from me. You took my ice cream, you took it away from me. Oh, yeah! Now you're getting it. Now listen up. But I'm still not sad. I'll just have a cookie. No, 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 man. You almost had it. Come on, like this. You took away my ice cream. You took it away from me. I don't care about no cooking! Woo! Now try it again. My cookies and ice cream, they both gone away. That's right. Mm -hmm, feel it. My cookies and ice cream, they both gone away. Oh, sweet, man. Sweet. But that don't bother me none. I got me my freshly baked strudel. What? Strudel? Man, you can't say strudel in the blues. That don't even rhyme. Well, what about poodle? Because I got a poodle. Ha! Oh, no, don't tell me you're going to eat that poodle. No, I'm just going to pet him. Petting poodles makes me happy. Sorry, man. You way too happy to sing the blues. Hello. Would you like to poker? Sure. <laughs>
Don't got no ice cream, no cookies, no strudel. Don't got no ice cream, no cookies, no strudel. But I'm your lady, your lady, your lady happy too. Just here with my poodle. That's right. Oh yeah, I'm your lady, your lady, your lady happy too. Just me and my poodle. This has been the Blues with Len. Tune in next time to... Oh, never mind. Larry's not likely to be singing the blues again anytime soon. And now it's time for Helpful Humanitarian Songs with Mr. Lunt. The part of the show where Mr. Lunt comes out and sings a Helpful Humanitarian Song. Well, he's a mangy old pet. If you saw him, I bet you'd walk the other way. So sad and alone, with his hair overgrown, like a stinky old toupee. But doggies have feelings, and doggies need love. And doggies like those deep fried treats that come from up above. Oh, donuts for Peggy. Please give a glaze to make him smile. Thank you, ma'am, for troubled beast. Won't you at least comfort him a while? Sir, can you spare a donut for Peggy? Please help my doggy friend. Thank you, kind sir, a honey dip would really help his broken oh, heart oh, to oh. man. His broken heart to man. Well, just look at this pup. <laughs> he's brightening up. Oh, he's looking not so weak. Oh, Benny, <laughs> his outlook was grim till you get pastry. To him. Oh, look, he wants to speak. Oh, doggies have feelings. And doggies need love. Yes, boy. And doggies like sweet, doughy treats that come from a papa. Oh, we are all again, baby. Around, around, around. These donuts are dreamy, they're filling. Hey, Dreamy, no, don't let my pizza to grow. Maybe you shouldn't have any more donuts. No, 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 don't give him any more. They make him crazy. Like Jerry Lewis. No, no, no more donuts for the dog. Oh, man, this is a terrible idea. What are we doing? This has been Helpful Humanitarian Songs with Mr. Lunt. Tune in next time to hear Mr. Lunt say, Don't give donuts to dogs! And now it's time for Silly Songs with Larry. The part of Check it, the old dude. Yo, me and the boys had an idea about another way to tell this mo story. Right, boys? Yo! Yo, listen to the boys and we'll tell you now how losing your cool and having a cow can run you out when your lip gets flipped and get your mug up all over Egypt. Na, 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 On the banks of the Nile, born and but the pharaoh in his teenage days. Chilling, kicking, wearing silk jamsies. Learning hieroglyphics from his granddad Ramses when a whack Egyptian. Started whooping it up on his homie Hebrew. Would have called the cops, stood back, but instead, he took a big stick upside of his head. A man's down in Egypt. Our troubles are Now word spread 
fast and he got all scared. Oh. He'd be better off by avoiding the pharaoh. Oh. He packed his bags thinking if he'd stay, they'd be punishing him in a capital way. Oh. Oh. Now Lord only knew, but he thought he might stay a while in the desert like a million night to disengage his rage and become equipped to return to his home as a prince of Egypt. I guess down in Egypt, no moving day is near. Na 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 na. Unless the prince of Egypt will take us out of here. Na 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 na. Hey. Ah, no. Let's stick with the western. See you guys. And now it's time for Silly Songs with Larry, the part of the show where Larry comes out and sings a silly song. We join our veggie friends for their annual Easter tradition. Okay, kids, ready for the Easter egg hunt? Yay! <laughs> I've got my hat. I've got my net. I've got binoculars, metal detector. I'm set for an expedition. I'm a cute on a mission. The greatest Easter egg hunt yet. I'm good to go. I'll find the prize. At the safari store, I bought out all their supplies. Life will be sweet when my beautiful treat is right before my eyes. My golden egg has my name on it. It will be mine, all mine, all mine, because I want it. It's there for the picking from the funnier chicken. Soon I'll be holding my golden egg. I came to take this darkest jungle. There are many scary things. I am always on the lookout for whatever bites or stings. I run or creep down low. I go wherever eggs may roam. Remember. Professional, so don't try this at home. No luck? Okay, my search will widen. To just be on this lava pit, I'm sure that's where it's hiding. I overcome each hardship, I make it through each mess because I must possess my golden egg. Has my name on it. It will be mine, all mine, all mine, because I want it. It's there for the picking from a bunny or chicken. Soon I'll be holding. My golden egg. I missed it. Oh, look, I found it. And now she has her happy hands around it. I'm defeated. A lot of nothing's what I got. But maybe, but maybe, but maybe not. I still have my golden egg. Thanks to the caring of my competitor whose heart believes in sharing. This foil's made for peeling. What a wonderful feeling. Cause now we are holding our golden egg. This has been Silly Songs with Lenny. Tune in next time to hear Lenny say, This is awesome. I love Meg. And now it's time for Ukulele Karaoke with Bob, the part of the show where Bob comes out and sings an Ukulele Karaoke. Uh, what's going on? You are doing the Ukulele Karaoke, no? No, I'm on a break. Uh, this is the Pirates. They are busy with the rest of the show. But I, I, I don't even know the song. Your lyrics, monsieur. Bring in the props. Uh, but wait, I... <laughs> Monsieur! Hold on a sec. I'm totally unprepared to do a solo. Your backup singers. What? Isn't that the... Three. They are the Wiggly Turtle Tubies. The Wiggly Turtle Tubies? They look taller on TV. So do you, Tomato! Uh, but really, this is Larry's gig. I can't just... This show must go on, Monsieur. Quick, that is your cue. Just follow along, you will be fine. But... Let's that turtle. Aloha, Lance. Let's that turtle dance, dance, dance. Let's that turtle. Aloha, Lance. Let's that turtle dance, dance, dance. 
Well, I keep a little turtle at my uncle and my aunt's. My Annie's name is Myrtle, and my island turtle's name is Lance. He doesn't wander far, even if he has a chance. He just plays his ukulele, and he does the hula dance. What? He threw a luau barbecue one breezy summer night, invited all his turtle pals to come and have a weeky bite. The turtle started walking there as Lance began to swing. The one that lived across the street arrived there in the spring. Oh, I get it. Turtles are slow. <laughs> so I took them a long time. <laughs> That's pretty good. Lance the turtle. Aloha, Lance. Lance the turtle. Dance, dance, dance. But Lance just kept on cooking. He was grilling full of glee. He was marinating ribs because he likes uh, syrup with his feta cheese. Uh, I'm sorry. I. Lance's purple turtle shell has ketchup, if you please. Pineapples are shiny, spotted tiki bumblebees. Oh, man. Lance and turtle. Aloha, Lance. Lance and turtle. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Hey, guys, I don't think this is right. It doesn't make any sense. It works for us. <laughs> but this one, this one. Uh, there are luscious chocolate fingers spinning slowly in the school. Malay Kalikimaka. Fluffy bunnies driving in the pool. <laughs> Larry. A thousand igloos wax the feet, spray luggage in the tree, raining puppies, flying clown, flossing puna hele. Ow! Oh, forget it. Woohoo! The packet sneezes coconuts, the heeny yo yo leg, white meaty whiskey jetty sauce, the meg's a fuzzy parrot bag, paper plastic porcupine, the horsey makes his bed, the hooma hooma nuku nuku abo awas in bed. Lance and turtle, hello, Lance. This has been Ukulele Karaoke with Bob. Tune in next time when Bob says... I'll be in my dressing room. Dance, dance, dance. And now it's time for Silly Songs with Best Friends Forever. The part of the show where Best Friends Forever come out and sing a silly song. You're my BF. You're my BFF. You're my BF and FL. My B F F L N M W. G I think you're swell. T for B U T X U two. U R W L O L. My B F F L N M W. G I think you're swell. There's no one like you. You're so easy to talk to. It's a green. All we need is punctuated conversations with some brief abbreviations. One thing I know, I am H O O I A N A L. So true. I'll always be your left sign three, cause G, I, I think, think you're swell. swell. I think so too, you see, F U, you'll never be O T L. With you, I am in V G C, cause G, I think you're swell. There's no one like you. You're so easy to talk to. It's a green. All we need is concise communication with a lot of conversations. comes out and sings a silly song. Another lonely day in a crowded town making our way the best we know how but we're moving up Yo, up, up, up. we're moving Oh, coming at ya. Got a 
dishes packed. Yeah, they are stacked. They've been wrapped to win. Oh, take the porcelain. I ain't gonna break it. Yo, listen no up. No way. Even if I shake it. Yeah. Barbara Manatee, you're still the one for me. The number two silly song of our first ten years, Endangered Love. We join Larry as he follows the tragic saga of Barbara Manatee in the daytime drama, Endangered Love. Barbara Manatee, you are the one for me. You've been so good to me But I must go into the world and do noble things for the good of all And you can't come because you don't speak French Au revoir But if you leave there, who will take me to the ball? Who's going to take me to the ball, Bill? I have a new dress and shoes A new manatee lipstick Who will take me to the ball? Take you to the ball, Barbara Manatee. Please don't go. I must. Don't go. I must. Don't. Must. Don't. Don't. Must. Must. Barbara Manatee. You are the one for me. Sent from up above. You are the one I love. should read a book. Yeah. Okay. This 
has been Silly Songs with Lamb. Tune in next time to hear Bill say, Barbara, I've learned to dance. Next up on Veggie Shopping Network, Pants. Welcome, viewers. What comes next? A pair of pants with stripes or checks? Dig in your wallet, dump out your purse. Who'll be the one to buy the first pair? You can wear them if you're big, you can wear them if you're small, their pants if you're short, and shorts if you're tall. You can wear them in the spring, you can wear them in the fall, their pants if you're short, and shorts if you're tall. So far, so far, down to 20. Look what you get for a little bit of money, down to your feet and up to your tummy. <laughs> if you buy right now tonight, we'll throw in a set of Ginsu knives. A pair of pants could change your life. One easy payment, $9.95. See the tag on the back, one size fits. Less than a squid. It's a verb for a dog and a noun for a kid. With a pair of pants, you're not alone. You can dance with your pants till the cows come home. This pair of pants will win your heart. We accept most credit cards. A stretchy waist, elastic band. Makes need your buffet eating pants. Sills or slacks or corduroys. Pants bestow a special joy. As seen on the screen of your TV, these pants can hide unsightly knees. This pair is made of high grade vinyl. Don't hesitate, all sales are final. To summarize, you might recall their pants. Short and shorts if you're tall. Four, three, two, one. Going, 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 done. We're out of pants. We gotta run. Pants. You've got some skinny legs. Pants. And now it's time for an installment in the history of fashion with Archibald. The part of the show where Archibald comes out and shares a lesson in the history of fashion. In the olden days, the biggest craze with the folks who lived back then of the bourgeoisie and accessory for the women and the men. Not pant or shirt, nor blouse or skirt, or anything made from thread, but woven hair from horse or bear situated on the head. Our astonishing wigs! They're enormously big! We love our astonishing wigs! Astonishing wigs, astonishing wigs, do you like our astonishing wigs? From most famous queens of greatest means to the lowly Duchess Fair ran a common thread upon the head for those unhappy with their hair. Now you can bet that even pets and livestock would confer. So wigs they took to improve the look of their bristles and their fur. Our astonishing wigs! They're enormously big! We love our astonishing wigs! Astonishing wigs, astonishing wigs, do you like our astonishing wigs? We are the pigs in wigs, yes our locks are very big And we squiddle without a care in our artificial hair Our hearts are most enthralled since pigs like us are bald So we'll sing and we'll smile and we'll probably flaunt the style of our astonishing wigs quick, quick. And so it's said, this fashion spread from the lofty to the low. From prince to pig, the look was big and continued thus to grow. Hence, girls and boys would dress their toys in manufactured mops. Then bush and tree soon too would see small wigs upon their tops. Ah. Our astonishing wigs! They're enormously big! We love our astonishing wigs! Astonishing wigs, astonishing wigs, do you like our astonishing wigs? These are our wigs in wigs, yes, our locks are very big, and they dance without a care in their artificial hair. We don't panic if their hair gets problematic. We just sit back and smile for the fabricated style. Of our <laughs> astonishing wigs, astonishing wigs. So you think I'm silly? Well, yes. This has been an installment in the history of fashion with Archibald. Tune in next time to hear Archibald say, So then, after a while, wigs went out of fashion and everyone turned to bell bottoms. Oh, brother. Our astonishing wigs! And now it's time for Silly Songs with Larry, the part of the show where Larry comes out and sings a silly song. Asteroid, 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 asteroid cowboy. Yeehaw! Oh, my little rocky doggy, your orbit has been stirred. Don't you dare be sneaking out, gotta get back in the herd. It's lonely.
Time for Silly Songs with Letty Boy, the part of the show where Letty Boy comes out and sings a silly song. We join the league at supper time as they sit down for a meal prepared by Alfred. I don't want to eat my Brussels sprout. He doesn't want to eat his Brussels sprout. And I really, really don't like sauerkraut. Icky, slimy, stinky sauerkraut. My appetite is zero. No need to shed a tear roll. You need a supper hero. What's a supper hero? Got diddles you don't want to chew. Yeah, not too appetizing. Don't wanna eat what's cooked for you. No, not really. Then citizen, don't fear, oh, I am the supper hero. He is the supper hero. Yummy, 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 Thanks. I like this supper hero. This pasta dish has gotten cold. I beg your pardon? This fish stick looks a little old. It's not that old. You can't go on, I must insist. It's my duty to assist. Well, I'm kind of hungry. Good citizen, don't fear, oh. I am the supper hero. He is the supper hero. Yum, 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 I was going to eat that. Don't worry, folks, for me it's fun. A supper hero's job's not done. Yummy, 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 yum, yum, yum. Till every supper plate is clean, no matter what type of cuisine. Yummy, 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 yum, yum, yum. Who let him in? Hey, is that chocolate? I love chocolate. Oh, wait! Yummy, 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 yum. Yummy, 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 yum, yum, yum. Ah, good citizens, don't fear, oh, and be of good cheer, oh. I love my new career, oh. I am the supper hero. Dude, he ate our cake. So, what do you say, guys? Can I join the league? This has been Silly Songs with Letty Boy. Tune in next time to hear the league say... No. no. Yummy, 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 yum. It's true. I will explain it to you. As only an opera. Great 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 grandfather and my great 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 grandmother I forget how many greats well they lived in different families lived in different families who didn't like each other My name's Antonio Cucaroni and we eat some pasta only buscatini rigatoni We like a penny cannelloni Don't call them new Cheesy gorgonzola. Oh, it's smelly. But I still want some in my belly. That's because we like our food extremely cheesy. <laughs> <laughs> Have you met my son, the Tony? Makes a mean a macaroni. My Maria makes a charming tossy cheese. Someday she'll meet a man who comes from her own clan. No son of mine will ever marry a cumbery. My 
I still forget how many greats, though their families were enemies. Maria and Tony liked each other. Nothing to see here. Let's just skip to the end. That's how my great 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 grandfather and my great 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 grandmother. I still don't know how many greats, but they brought together the family. Brought together the family and invented macaroni and cheese. The cheese and macaroni. It's a macaroni and cheese. It's great, 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 great. This has been Silly Songs with Ben. Tune in next time to hear Antonio say... It's a great! And now it's time for Silly Songs with Larry, the part of the show where Larry comes out and sings a silly song. There once was a boy who lived in a house and the house sat under a tree. By the tree ran a fence that stretched far and wide Round the gated community Can I have my ball? Can you get my ball? I kicked it into the tree And my ball bounced up And my ball dropped in To the gated community Oh, the gated community is where we like to be. Everything's so lovely, oh, our hearts are filled with glee. And when you come to visit, you can stand outside and see what a lovely bunch we are in our gated unity. Um, can I have my ball? Can you get my ball? I kicked it into the tree. And my ball bounced up. And my ball dropped in to the gated community. Oh, the gated community is where we like to be. Our clothes are never dirty and our lawns are always green. And when you come to visit, you can stand outside and see what a tiny bunch we are in our gated unity. The gated community, we think you will agree, is pleasantly devoid of unsightly street and free. Free, free of the free. Gated community, our smiles are wide when we are in comfy custody. And when you come on, you stand outside. What a smiley bunch we are in a gated unity. Can I get my ball? Can I get my ball? I like to be. 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 This has been Silly Songs with Larry. Oh, look! A ball! Tune in next time to hear Larry say... Thank you. Celery, gotta be, and 